Well, hello everybody and welcome back to another edition of the Forex Market Preview. Today we're going to take a look at the Aussie dollar and a cipher pattern that's setting up. We're also going to take a look at some structure trading on the pound and the euro pound is putting in a very nice Gartley pattern that just completed and may give us an opportunity to take a look at a trading opportunity this week. Also on this edition of the Forex Market Preview, I announced the registration, the open registration for my Into the Gray online seminar that I'm going to be holding on the 18th. So I'll explain all the details on that in this edition of the Forex Market Preview. Well, it is a very snowy and a very cold day here in Kansas City, and I'm here uh, this Sunday afternoon coming to you live from what is now Studio B uh, here in Kansas City. And I barely made it home. My car is not built for the cold, and uh, so we're going to see if we can knock this thing out, and then I'm going to go enjoy another cup of coffee. I get comments on my coffee cup uh, every time I do this. This is not, in fact, a camera lens, but a coffee cup, so enjoy. Now, this week, we're going to talk about a few things. Um, number one, let's just go ahead and kick this thing off. On the Aussie, we've got a nice cipher pattern setting up here. And I'm just going to go ahead and draw this in for you rather than bore you with all of the ratios and things uh, like that. I'm going to just go ahead and draw it in visually for you. So this is what a cipher pattern looks like. Okay. And essentially what we have is a break of structure, uh, a move down, followed by a retracement, followed by a break of structure to the downside. So the market acts, does a, a fake like it's going to go lower, and then it shoots back up. And we're going to shoot back up into a 786 retracement, which is what we did right here. And we tap that 786 retracement. That is our short at 99.94. Now, this completed on Friday. And so we're going to have to wait and see if the market will come back up into that area. I will tell you, I, 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 wouldn't, I don't chase these. So if I hit something like this and I missed it, well, then I'm going to wait and, and set my limit orders and hope that the market will come back up and retest. Now, if the market is trading higher than my entry level, well then naturally I'm going to go ahead and take that trade because I've increased my risk reward profile. But this is a shorting opportunity. So we are looking for this market to go south. Like that. And this is on the daily chart. Stops are going to have to go back here above uh, 90.84, 90.85. So it's going to be a little bit wider stop. Like I said, um, this is something that we I do. I teach this stuff to you guys and, and show it to you more as a visual representation, as an idea for, uh, for you and your own trading. If you know how to trade the cipher pattern, if you've been through the advanced pattern trader course or the 12-week transformation or something like that, then you know how to trade these patterns and, uh, and you're going to be into that. If not, then what we're doing is training your eye, giving you a little bit of education on how I see the markets, and basically giving you one man's opinion. Um, this Forex Market Preview, of course, is not designed to be a, uh, you know, a signal service for you guys. And, uh, and so we just, I'm, I'm here to educate. So as this thing presses down, we get the 382 retracement, the market presses down, and then we get this rally into the 786. Now, we're sitting, of course, against a little bit of minor structure back here, but the expectation here is that this market would continue lower. So that's uh, you know, a nice little move there, uh, just a nice cipher pattern on the Aussie dollar. Let's shift over to the pound here for a minute and take a look. Now, if you guys uh, are syndicate members, one of the things we talked about was the, uh, the the breakdown. I gave you guys a selling opportunity here on on this particular market, right about here at uh, 65.84s, and then the market rolled over like a waterfall, and we traded sideways here, and now we've spiked back up. And so the question is, what do we do now with this? Because technically, we've kind of held the lows here. And when I drop down to a four-hour chart, so what I'm going to do is drop from a daily chart down to a four-hour chart. And I'm going to show you guys what this looks like on the four-hour chart. Now, I've already identified where my structure level is, and that's pretty clear. The market came down, we got the rally, and then the market rolled over. Now we're rallying up. Where are we going to rally up into? Well, previous structure support, which should now become resistance, comes in very close to a 618 retracement. So we identify a potential reversal zone here. Okay, And we say, okay, if the market gets there and I end up selling... When the market gets here at 6,500, so we've got the 6,500 even handle there. So let's say we sold 6,496s. Let me just go ahead and drop a line in here. 
64, well, close enough. Boom, somewhere in there. I don't make this red to identify, well, we'll make it purple. Make this purple to identify where our trade took place, and this, of course, would be a selling opportunity. Okay, if the market goes up there, where does my where do my stops have to go? Well, look left. Structure leaves clues. There's the previous swing high. So stops will have to go above 162.24s. So let's say 162.44s would be our stops somewhere in there, and we'll identify a little red line there. Pop. There we go. Apply it. And now we've got a red line for where our stop is. So our entry is here, and that is the distance to our stop. I don't know if I can draw a straight line here. That's the distance to our stop. Now, where, if the market does get up there, are we going to seek our first targets? Well, look left. Structure leaves clues. This is where the market previously found support. So is it highly likely that the market may find support there again? Yes, it is. So we want to make sure that we're at least taking off some of our profits at that previous structure level. So if I'm shorting the market here and I'm looking for an initial target down here, then look at my reward. All right. And if I take this line, that was this is my stop on the right. And this is my potential reward. I'm looking at a better by probably 1.2 three to one risk reward ratio here. It's a very, very nice risk reward ratio and it, it plays off the structure. It's playing off the market returning into structure and then seeing a continuation of the downside. Now if we get caught in a channel here, that may present us with other trading opportunities. But for right now, we're looking for still some trend continuation at least back down into structure. Now Guys, these are very, very basic principles about trading. Um, they're basic concepts about structure analysis and about techn technical, an uh, technical analysis that every trader, in my opinion, should know. It should not be an option for you if you're a trader, especially a retail trader, to not understand the basic functions about how markets move and why markets move. And one of the things that I'm doing on the 18th is I'm teaching a free half-day seminar on not only technical analysis, but also uh, talking a lot about the psychology behind why we fail and why traders have so much trouble taking action on very simple and very easy to understand and very easy to execute uh, trading methodologies. And I'm calling it into the gray. And if you guys missed it, it was on the YouTube page. If you're on my list, you emailed it. I just want to play the short two-minute uh, uh, commercial for that right now so that you guys can see it. And so go ahead and watch this, and then we'll talk a little bit more. Hi there. My name is Jason Stapleton, and I'm the head of currency trading at Trade Empowered. Trading can be an exciting adventure with massive profit potential. Many fortunes have been won and lost in the markets. But for a lot of people, trading is not an enjoyable experience. You see, most traders enter the market in a fog. They're uneasy, uncertain about what they should do, and about what the market will do. Most of them have racked up a dozen indicators on their charts, all giving them conflicting information. And when a trader finally gets up the courage to place a trade, well, the market immediately goes against him. Frantically, he searches the internet, desperately looking for answers. He turns on CNBC or Bloomberg, hoping, praying he'll find some reason that will explain why he just lost a small fortune. He grasps at straws as he wanders in vain through the haze of market confusion. He's trading in the gray in that space between black and white where nothing he does makes sense and nothing he d tries seems to work. What he doesn't realize is it doesn't have to be that way. Does that sound familiar? Well, if it doesn't, I want to invite you to a very special one-time only training event where I'm going to take you inside the markets and show you a world that you didn't know existed. I'm going to take you into the gray. And during this half-day event, I'm going to show you a method for trading any market on any time frame. And I'm going to share with you some of the secrets that I've spent the last decade learning. And when we're all done, you're going to have a confidence in your trading that you never thought possible. There are no proprietary indicators, no complex rules or confusing formulas. Just you and me and a chart. We're going to strip away all of the fat and all of the confusion. And I'm going to show you just how simple and exciting and empowering trading can be. There's nothing else like it in the world. So sign up right now. You'd be so glad you did.
Okay, so that event is on the 18th, and you can register for it right here by clicking on the link that's on this video right now, or by going to the About section of this video if you're on YouTube, and just clicking on that link. And it's an entirely free event, it's entirely online, there's no limit to the number of people that we can have there, and I would really like to make this a very big event. We have about 2,000 people who are registered already. I would love to see five or 10,000 people there. And so if you guys are enjoying what you're seeing here, if you're passionate about trading, if you if you believe in the in the concepts and principles that I teach, then I want you to do me a big favor. Um, I need your help. I need you to send this to your friends, send this to your trading groups, get on the Forex Factory and and any of the other you know blogs that you might be part of and just share this information with them. Just say, hey, it's completely free. He's gonna be teaching for three or four hours on this concept of trading psychology and structure analysis. And my hope is is that I will get a chance to get in front of and and preach this message of consistency and profitability to thousands and thousands and thousands of people that I haven't been able to reach. And it's going to be in our new studios at Trade Empowered. It's going to be shot um, much like a, a you know like a regular show would be. So we're going to have a lot. Of, you're going to get a lot of FaceTime with me, some time on the whiteboard. We're going to do a Q&A at the end. You're going to have a chance to send in your questions um, throughout the training so that we can answer those. It's, there's just a lot that's going to be happening there, and it's going to be completely different than anything that you've ever experienced in terms of a training event online, and it's going to be totally free. So do me a favor, share this video, share the video on YouTube of, uh, of the event and how to register, and let's see if we can't drive five or 10,000 people to that live event. be very, very exciting stuff. So the last thing that I want to show you today is something on Euro Pound. Euro Pound is setting up a really nice Gartley pattern here. And I'm on the four hour chart. I'll just go ahead. I'm come out to the daily chart and show it to you on the daily chart. It's it's apparent there as well. I actually picked this up on the daily chart. But you can see the movement that happened that's happened here. Okay? It's actually might be a little bit easier to see on this chart. So let me delete my retracement here. And we'll just use the extension. So we've got the initial leg down, okay? Followed by the 618 retracement, which we get here followed by another 618 slash 786 retracement there, and then a projection up into the 127 extension. And look at how the market, right along that 127 extension, what does it come into? It comes into previous structure resistance. Market respects that structure, and we hold that 127 extension. You have the ability, with this type of Gartley pattern, which has a very deep A to B retracement, to set your orders to sell right against structure. And then we'd be looking at the highs coming in here around uh, 83.48s. So 68s would be your stop. Um, so 48, 68 would be your stop. With your profit potential being, in this case, a 382 and a 618. So if I'm doing the same thing again, looking at my risk, here's my risk on this particular trade. Okay, If I'd have entered at the 127 as the rules dictate. Here is target one. So I've got a two to one risk reward to target one, and then I don't even know what that is to target two, probably a four or five to one to target two. These are exceptional trading opportunities from a risk reward basis, and we know over time, I mean, Akil tracks this in his live room trading these patterns. We know tracking this stuff that this is 60, 65, 70% accurate depending on how long you've been trading it and what chunk of data you're looking at. So, you know, Upwards of 75 or upwards of 70% accurate, seven out of every 10 Gartley patterns that you're going to take will produce you a profit. I mean, that is a really, really nice risk reward when you can get two to one, four to one, five to one on a, uh, on a trade that produces you profit 65 to 70% of the time. It's just very, very nice. It's something that we want to take every single time. And this one just so happens to be really in the direction of the underlying trend. We have one break of structure here, which we get with every single Gartley pattern, but it's with the underlying trend. So uh, a very, very nice trading opportunity, shorting opportunity there as well. Um, well, that's all I've got for you this week, guys. Again, register for the in, uh, Into the Gray 
training series that I'm going to do on the 18th. Make plans to attend. Share it with your friends, your relatives, anybody you think might have an interest. This is not just about currency trading. The stuff that I'm going to teach you will work for stocks, for options, for just about anything you want to look at in terms of making decisions about where markets will go and what drives market activity and also the psychology behind why we fail as traders. And so I'm very, very excited to have the opportunity to speak with you in that type of venue, and, uh, and we're going to have a great time. So until then, good luck and good trading. I'll talk to you soon.